I can feel my mouth puckering up and salivating just thinking about this plant. This is the Meyer lemon. It's an awesome plant that you can actually grow inside the home during the cold winter months. And then you put it outside in the summertime and during the summertime, it really absorbs all the sun's energies so that when you bring it inside the home, it produces beautiful fruit inside the home in the winter time. If you've ever been to California um, in January or February, that's when all of the lemon groves are actually producing their beautiful fruit. So how do you know when to pick your fruit? It's So really, it's actually very easy to know. Okay, so the first thing that happens is the plants start by producing flowers. The flowers are incredibly fragrant. They smell kind of like a jasmine and um, ylang ylang, and it just they're fruity, they're citrusy, they're beautiful. But then after the flowers have finished, you can see this flower is just ending. What happens is they leave room for a little baby fruit to start growing. Oh, but that's green, you say. Yes, actually, all citrus, lemons, limes, oranges, they all start out green. And then as they mature, they will actually take on color. So you can see this is one plant with one type of fruit in it, Meyer lemons. Okay, so we saw the little babies that started out green. And then you can see these ones over here. No, these are not limes. These are not key limes. These are Meyer lemons in the making. Then as they continue to grow and to plump up, they start to take on a little bit more yellow hue. So how do you know when they are ready to pick? They're ready to pick when they are fully yellow. And when they're fully yellow like this, they're nice and soft on the exterior. And even if you take a whiff, you can even start to smell that wonderful luscious juice on the inside. So when they are nice and plump like this, that is your cue. Oh, and even they will just kind of gently come off with just a simple pluck of the hand. You don't even need to cut them off. Whereas when they are still green, they're not going to pull off so easily. Let's see, this one will just kind of pop right off just like that because this guy is ready to go. When you cut it open, it's nice and soft, nice and juicy. You can see all of the juice just emanating right from that little guy. And mm -mm -mm. do a little taste test. You know that it's good to go. Meyer lemon, it is an amazing plant, suitable for any house plant garden, a uh, rather large plant that we keep in a rather large home. If you have a smaller home like myself, I have a smaller plant. And really the way to keep them smaller is by planting them in smaller containers. If you plant it in a large pot, it's gonna grow large. Small pot, it stays small. All you really need to do to succeed with the Meyer lemon is give them a lot of sunlight out in the summertime, keep them outside for as long as possible, giving them regular watering and lots of beautiful fertilizer throughout the growing season. And what that's gonna do, you're gonna give it all of the requirements that it needs so that when you bring it back inside the home in the winter time, it's ready to start producing those beautiful, plump, juicy fruit that are perfect for Meyer lemonades, Meyer lemon pie, Meyer lemon cocktini, cocktini, cocktail, martini, something like that. Um, but the flavor is, is unbelievable. You will blow your taste buds out of the park if you grow these beautiful Meyer lemons. And if you do wanna grow one, just search Grow With Robertas and you can find a selection of some of my favorite indoor plants and outdoor plants like this gorgeous Meyer lemon. And so you can add it to your garden. Anyways, I will catch you guys later. Ciao.